ladies, this is Lori from Lori's Lemonade Stand coming to you today to give you a new wig review. I have on In Charge by Raquel Welch in color RL 6 slash 28 bronzed sable. Oh, this is uh, new to their, um, what is this, winter, spring, spring collection 2020? I don't know, whatever it is. Anyway, it's a new wig to their collection. This is one of my favorite colors by Raquel Welch. I love the um, dark six color and then the 28 that's weaved in with it, which is a red color. Uh, to me, this is very attractive. It's uh, The color is face framing. That's what Raquel Welch is known for, um, that profile. And um, to me, it makes my eyes pop. I absolutely love this color. So let me go over this wig, go over this wig with you. Super cute. So she has these longer layers and some nice wave to her at, at a chin length bob. This is fun. Let me give you a, um, a tour of her 360. Front, side, back. You see how it's, it's shorter here in the back? It's got some layers at the crown to give her some height and then side. Now what I have found, there are a couple of people that wear wigs, types of people. Those that like it flat to the head, this wig can do that. See how flat you can make her? The reason why you can make this one so flat, she has no permatease, but this heat defiant fiber gives you the ability to do whatever you want with the hair itself. See how flat and sleek that can look? Now, I'm not a flat and sleek kind of girl. I have a little head, and so I like big hair. And plus, I'm from the South. So to me, the bigger the hair, the better. I like poofing her up and making her big. Heat defined fiber allows you to do that. See how big I can make this hair? And all I did was use my fingers, and she'll stay like this. I love this. And throughout the day, one thing that um, I want to recommend is when you're wearing a wig, you want to make it your own. This is now your hair. So what you used to do with your hair, you can do with a wig. So if you used to put it behind your ear, put it behind your ear. If you're used to putting both sides behind your ear, you know, put both sides behind your ear. Now, I don't have any hair, so it's very important to make sure that you have a little bit of sideburns so it doesn't look wiggy or fake. Oh, that's so cute. If you used to put headbands in, put headbands in. If you pulled it up, you know, pull it up. I was notorious. This was my favorite style when I had hair. I always did this little poof right here. This wig would be perfect for that. This actually, I think I'm going to wear this wig today. I love this. Isn't that cute? Oh my goodness. All right, let me go over the dimensions of this wig for you. So the front is seven and three quarters inches. The crown is seven inches. The sides are six and a half and the nape is three and it weighs 4.1 ounces. My rule of thumb is less than five ounces. Anything more than five ounces is too heavy for me and I'm gonna start feeling it throughout the day. Okay, she has a lace front and she has a lace part. I love this wig. All right, let me show you the cap construction. Okay, she has a lace front, lace part, classic wefted sides and back. Her ear tabs are covered with felt. Her nape is covered with felt and it's extended. And she has Velcro strap, adjustable straps. And this memory um, strips are on here. This right here I believe is probably a memory three cap and what that means is the more you wear it the more it conforms to your head. Um, this is an average size cap and I have a little head and I found it to be a little bit roomy on my head. Let me put it back on and, and I'm gonna feel that. So yeah, this cap is a medium sized cap, but as you can see, it's got a lot of movement in it. What's nice about the adjustable straps is you can adjust it either bigger or smaller, an inch to an inch and a quarter. So usually when I cinch it down on the average, it fits me really well. Another tip that I wanna let you guys know about that really helps me 
is on lace front wigs, I like using got to be glued, and I glue my lace front down. It really makes that lace invisible, plus it provides a cushion between my head and the lace, because sometimes this lace gets itchy. And then the third thing is, is it really holds it on your head, so it's not going anywhere. Where I live, it's very windy here, and so everyone always asks me, has your wig ever fallen off? Will it blow off? My wig has never fallen off. And it's funny because this is loose, but it doesn't fall off. I'm very confident wearing it in the wind and it doesn't go anywhere. And sometimes if it's like really windy, I might just like have an itch right here and I hold it in place just for a moment to keep it there. Oh, I love this style. I love these little curly things here. It's shorter in the back. Very cute. Okay, she's available at my boutique located at 13980 Gadara Drive in Rancho Cucamonga, California, or at my website, wwwlauris lemonade standcom I'm by appointment only, so you can call at 909-803-0310 to make an appointment, or go to my website and make an appointment. I hope you enjoyed this review. You guys have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.